first of all, can you readdress the question of patient failing covalent? Are you going first to non-covalent or are you going to CAR-T? And if they move up the line, how do you see sequences in the future? I think it really depends upon your patient population you're talking about. Is it an older patient? Is it a patient who could get CAR T cell if they are physically and um, able to get CAR T cell? I probably would do that. If they're not able to do that, then um, definitely pertubrutinib is probably a better option. I think it is going to be moving up the line. You also have to remember that uh, these patients can sometimes relapse very late. I think I was going to ask a question of what everybody's personal record is, but mine is um, a patient who went through an intensive induction therapy and auto transplant many years ago, relapsed 22 years later. So um, obviously what we have available 22 years later for that patient is different than what might have been uh, earlier. So uh, we are continue to develop things and hopefully we'll have many more opportunities for patients.